So this is just for network marketers. How can you actually not chase people but attract them? So I'm going to share. Uh, I'm just going to share two tips with you. Tip number one is whatever when you attend trainings vigorously take notes and share those notes with people online get to talk about the things that you've learned tell people i just learned this oh i just learned how to do a video and how to place my cameras and all of that i just learned how to stay in front of the camera i just learned this i just learned that i just learned how to be more attractive here are the tips one two three four share with people people like you when you're human when you're not coming like a superstar and know everything you make mistakes, share with them what you're learning, what you've learned. Oh, I'm learning how to do my business online using social media tools. These are the tools that I've come to see and they're really phenomenal. Share with people. Share you attract them to you. Number two, are you a network marketer and then you're into health and wellness? Never ever share the name of your company. Never ever share the branding, a picture of your company, whatever. Never do that. Because there are lots of health, health and wellness products here and there. But what you need to do is go look for health and wellness blogs, health and wellness magazines. Look at the problems that your products solve. Talk about the problems. Quote, refer to those notable resources. And talk about the problems, talk about the solutions. And then direct people to reach you reach out to you if they want to know more because once you are able to take a problem and break it into bits and pieces and also also highlight the solutions if people want the solution they come to you and say do you really have the solution do not go to somebody they've never heard okay how that helps you if you're in a health and wellness niche stop putting all this stuff online it's really hurting your business okay if you're putting your company's logo posting about your your company online okay it really hurts you and let me tell you how it hurts you it hurts you in two ways number one is that it raises it raises resistance but if nobody knows about your company and you are talking eloquently you are giving solutions it raises curiosity curiosity is what breeds attraction so when people are not curious, they're not attracted to you. It's like that, even in human relations. Why is everybody tilting towards this guy? Why is it that once he talks, people listen? Why is she so, why is she like this? I want to know more. It's like that, everywhere. But when people already, first thing, they know everything about you, immediately they create resistance. So once you, oh, she wants to talk about that company. He wants to talk about this company. You don't want to be there. But number two, is that is that the moment you mention about your company or the products and you give the name people go and do their own research so when they do their own research they don't need you anymore trust me when they get on google they'll read so much about your business <laughs> then they'll become even better they'll even know better than you know at this time at the time of probably posting that all right so you want them to you want the curiosity to lead them to you remember your number one job is to sell and the number one step to selling in this on this this part of the world of the universe is to attract people and you want to attract them attraction it means you're attracting them. you don't want to push them somewhere else you want to attract them to you you don't attract them by running your mouth, by posting everything you like left, right, and center. You don't kill the curiosity and expect people to come to you. Be wise. Okay? Be wise. Don't resist that hunch. Okay? I hope this makes sense. This is a value to you. Share with your team. Share with your friends so that they don't keep making these mistakes and hurting themselves. All right? My name is Talon Obrebi Samuel. And as you always, always know, my sincere desire for you is that you go on succeeding by becoming a better version of yourself. I'll see you in another video. Bye for now.